All right, KTM fans, today I'm gonna to show you how to fix your KTM kickstand. If your bike comes with the longer kickstand bolt installed with this little collar, uh, remove that. The problem with that thing is, is when you tip your bike up, it auto rebounds. So while that might sound real neat and everything, uh, this kickstand isn't real great. It's a little bit too lightweight and it doesn't have a real good footprint and the reason i don't think it does is because it sits the bike too straight up and this bike weighs more than the other free rides so it was designed for the gas free rides and when you stick a 63 pound battery up here it doesn't stabilize the bike very well i would take it off except for part of the reason it's on there is because i actually use it i have to set up cameras and stuff for the videos so it does come in somewhat handy for me since i don't have a lot of trees and a lot of the riding areas that I ride at to lean against. Yeah, that thing comes up like that. So KTM provides a shorter bolt and I'm gonna install that and show you why it makes a difference. So with your KTM Freeride EXC, you're gonna get this little accessory pack. As a matter of fact, it probably comes with any KTM EXC model. And inside of it, you have all these little parts, most of them for the rear tail section, but you have this one bolt right here. And right here is the stock kickstand bolt. And it has that little collar on it and right there is the shorter bolt so what that does is that removes this collar so what that little collar does is when you put the kickstand down it doesn't allow that stainless bracket thing here to cam all the way over it puts some spring tension on there so when the load comes off the kickstand it has that spring tension to lift it back up so with that collar removed and the shorter bolt, what happens is that stainless steel bracket now isn't under load. And so the kickstand will stay down. And it'll actually cam over even more once I screw the bolt all the way in, but I wanted to demonstrate that for you. So the shorter kickstand bolt allows your kickstand to stay down all the time. And why that's critical is because when you're off-road, you're often on softer terrain and when the train starts to give way, the bike can move and what it'll do is it'll allow the kickstand to uh, kick back up and your bike crashes on the ground. So now I have the shorter bolt completely screwed in. We kick the kickstand down and it stays locked. You can see it's suspended from the ground. And I actually have to kick it to put it back up. So the other way, the way that it comes stock with this little guy in there, the reason they do that is probably because it technically uh, is a street bike also. And so this one comes installed because if you go on the street, you want that thing to kick up. And on pavement, it doesn't matter. The bike's less likely to fall over. So it's a very common feature on street bikes, which is probably why KTM did it on this bike. So there you have it, guys. Uh, switch the bolt out on your kickstand. Keep your bike from falling over and ripping grips, breaking levers, all those sorts of things. You don't need it, that feature off-road. So take it out. Trust me, you'll like it better. Thanks for watching the video. Catch you guys later.